Oh, my, my lens cap is on. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Profes professional vlogger. So we're going to Malaysia, Kuala Lumpur. Kuala Lumpur. First talk ever. I don't usually do talks, but Lot kind of convinced me. He said it's he said it's good there. There's a lens library. It's a library of lenses, but you don't have to be quiet in the lens library, which is good because I like talking. And we're going there to talk. Well, I just hope it is in focus because I'm using a Panasonic. <laughs> it is a Panasonic S1. Actually, I, and it is really heavy. Let me change another hand. Probably hell. And yeah, uh, oh yeah, someone's new, brand new, new camera, RX100 RX Mark 7 yes. with my input. I just had to buy a camera while I was here. You know, some people buy souvenirs. I buy cameras every time I go traveling. I got an RX100 7. Oh, oh it's time. Actually. It's oh. time for queuing up. Yes, this is what this video is about. A month ago, a whole month ago, I went with Kai to uh, Malaysia, Karumpo to deliver a talk. Someone invited us over there, the lens library in Malaysia. Back then, I've got the S1X and then the brand new 16-35 F4S Pro lens. The lens is not even available for purchase yet, not even now. Uh, Panasonic said that the um, lens will be available this month. It, it is the first ever vlogging lens for the Panasonic S series and because I went to Malaysia I was going to vlog so it's just a great opportunity to actually test the lens and the camera because I think vlogging is one of the greatest way to test a camera system because especially when I vlog I will rely on the camera to do auto focusing, auto exposure, uh, image stabilization but I have also done a full review of the S1X you should check out over there because in this video I'm not going to cover everything about the S1X but it is about what I found in a real life vlogging situation Kids open it. How 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 they expect the kids to open it? How did we open it before? I know. <laughs> oh, my like pet. It's the way forward. By the way, as I've mentioned, this is probably the first vlogging lens for Lumix S. It is mostly because how wide it is, 16 millimeters. Before this, the widest you can get is 24 millimeters. And I have mentioned many times before, 24 millimeters is just wide enough for vlogging. Now this is a 24mm, not very good for vlogging 24mm equivalent. I think it's the minimum requirement for vlogging, for selfie. Anything tighter than 24mm is too tight. Yes, exactly. Well, it works, but if you make it to 16mm, it is so much easier to include three or more people or everything around you. Are you, are you going, to, going to our talk? Uh, no, not really. I, I, I didn't, I didn't oh. expect to see you at all. Kai Wong and Oh, you can Hello. see us again tomorrow. Yes, you can see us at the talk. <laughs> right. Maybe yeah. early birds are still available. He just wants a selfie. He just wants a selfie. He doesn't want to go to a talk. He doesn't want to talking. He just wants a photo. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it then. Now, one thing I want you to pay attention is how stable these footage are. Especially this lens is not stabilized. This is not an OIS lens. All the stabilization is done in body in the S1X. And if you haven't heard about it, Panasonic in body stabilization is probably the best. That's oh, you got the money! Hey! Yeah, S1X. Yay, so not now mine. This, oh, you're, this is like, you know, he already used this for like two months or three months. Really? And we just launched it last week. We, we, we went to the launch <laughs> and everyone's like, yeah, yeah, we know, we know, yeah, it does 6K, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so well, when that, can we buy it? Well, that happened to me for really? other cameras. Oh, it's like, uh... <laughs> but it's got a tally lamp, so like, everybody yeah, knows you're vlogging really though. Wow. Well, well, you but it's good, it, it's good when it, you're... You can turn it off. You can turn it off, you can turn it off. yeah, yeah. I actually like it, I always like the tally lamps yeah. on the, the CC. And really. it's something so simple, Right. It's just a freaking idea. Yeah. I, 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 I don't really want to spend here with Locke when your idol is here. Oh my god! Guy <laughs> <laughs> more like Locke though. Really? Yeah, some, some people say that. Like, really? Yeah, good. You live the same. Let's go, let's go for food and get a, get a place. <laughs> I, get hot I think it's well long that Panasonic S series of full frame camera are heavy. And I have mentioned that many times before. From the S1, S1R and especially the S1H 
fully packed with features and of course when it's fully packed with features with stuff it's going to be heavy but how is it like when i'm vlogging with this heavy camera i like this kind of really really, really local well, actually i think vlogging with uh, such a heavy camera <laughs> yes. vlogging is fine because i don't i just pick it up for like okay half half a okay half you, a you put it down a lot one one minute or something like mm -hmm. that but if i use this Metal for armor. reveal <laughs> no <laughs> no no but, i mean when you're doing reveal you have to finish that Huh. Yeah, true, true. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And sometimes you have to do it mm -hmm. one or two times. It's a long time. duration. And especially I have to do it in Cantonese as well. <laughs> so, do it twice. And I have to carry another. Now, now, oh. I, now I start to shake. You probably can't see I'm shaking because the okay, IS is so mind, good. And this lens is particularly great for vlogging because this is so light. The weight of this lens is 500 gram. It's actually 18 gram uh, lighter than the 16-35 f4 I'm using it right now the Sony I forgot to mention it's the Sony so I've, I've just, been, just been challenged to hold this up for two minutes oh there we go two minute vlog on the S1H uh, oh again. man I'm feeling the burn now I can feel no way no shaking stable steady as a rock I, there's, the lactic acid is building up it's going to burn away the arm I'm just going to be left with, with some bone but I'm feeling good it's still, I'm still keeping it stable. The IS is good in the, the G8, G8, what? S1H? S1H. Stupid names. Halfway there, Jesus Christ. It's like doing the prank thing, you know. <laughs> let me have, let me have a bit of a drink. Mm. They did the WeBuild challenge, didn't they? We, we, we build S challenge? Hold, it, hold up for as long as you can. But and we'll the camera see. getting closer and closer. No way, no way. <laughs> I'm going to hold up with my tongue in a minute. I've had years and years of kind of wrist exercise. <laughs> A university. Seven seconds. So Six seconds. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Nail it. Yeah, and the, the camera right. is to the face. <laughs> <laughs> Famous with dropping things, so oh, hands off, please. Oh, I've got <laughs> oh no! I tried to kill it. I tried to kill it. It's come back. Nothing to do with less than real, okay? I bring it. I bring it. Okay, we uh, came. We, we, we came. <laughs> okay, we came to the KL Tower. KL Tower. Malaysia. This is the first time. Yeah, same for Lock and me. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, go ahead, Lui Pan. Oh, no. The low light on the S1H is great. Well, it has to be. It's full frame and then it, it's got dual ISO, dual base ISO. It basically means that it's great for low light. <laughs> Actually, my phone looks better. Look at this. Where? You look at the overall. Overall. Actually, I have never been to the highest building in Hong Kong unless it's for until it, until it's for a video. But I see. Yeah, see the where. We went. I thought we. I thought we went to meet that tray. Tray record. Not dinner. Not dinner tray. It's quite heavy. Hang on. <laughs> oh no! It's gonna fall off the edge. Oh. Yeah, I don't really, I, I don't know, it's not really my thing to go up tall buildings. But it, this is but nice. It is nice. Because it's, the building's quite short. Yeah. So yeah. you get to see quite far. Because it's so open. Are you going to get in it? Uh, if you are, I'm going to try. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's fine, but I saw some that the whole thing leaned out. <laughs> that's like, oh, whoa. No. Oh, it does feel old. Are you not afraid? You, 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 you really can't. Uh, <laughs> I. <laughs> it shut up. Shaking. Shut up. I think I don't know if it's the wind or what, but it wobble. It kind of moves a little bit. Oh my God! Oh, that is a oh. <laughs> Okay, I count to three and jump. Okay. Two, three. <laughs> 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 Just see the stay. I'm sure I'm good.
So that's why, that's why he's a YouTuber as well, and he always got comments about how he looks like Thai, and then he he, he have to print it out all out I to prove out, it. I printed out the comments. Just <laughs> shit, 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 shit in you. You're gonna have to do some merch, like a T-shirt. With... You need to see this one. <laughs> it kind of. <laughs> I clicked on this video because I thought he was Kai Wong. Chinese copy of the Kai. Two awesome. men's Kai Wong. <laughs> <laughs> like, there was a comment, like, why did you leave Digital Rev? I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> did they? <laughs> Actually, do you want to do my talk? Do, do. <laughs> yes, that's fried instant noodles. Yeah, but I mean, we have fried instant noodles in Hong Kong, it's different. I love fried instant okay. noodles. Uh, it's funny, isn't it? Instant noodles supposed to be instant and it's supposed to be quick and lazy food, but uh, instead you fry it, you, you, you spend your time. But it's good. <laughs> Think the idea of okay, you go to a restaurant and you're ordering instant noodles. That's not weird. Yeah. But when you taste, oh, spat on the spat on When you taste that, that is. Mwah. Yeah, I don't know what kind of spice in there. This is something I This way to aircon. Now, I have been bashing about the autofocusing on uh, Panasonic cameras GH5, S1, S1X. Well, Kai said that a lot of, as well. He is a GH5 user himself. You can kind of say that the focusing is actually fine because this whole frog, there's not a single clip that is totally out of focus. Oh, man. Woo, it's really hard. <laughs> I didn't think it would go to, right down to the last shot. And then it just kind of rolled in. It's just like, look yeah. at my hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but still, sometimes it just don't really know what it is doing. But the thing is, I don't know why that uh, the AI is really great in Panasonic uh, S1, S1X, S1R. The AI recognizes the humans, but the focusing is not focusing. <laughs> I needed to take poo, <laughs> so I thought, oh man, I can't hold it any in any longer. I, wanna, I, wanna... I don't know. It's the weight of poo. It just made it flush itself. It just went <laughs> straight down. Straight down. One is dropped. <laughs> Be overloaded. This is a way of saying goodbye. Let's talk about poos and, and shit yeah. and. Uh... I'm being good. Yeah, we, we don't want to be the plane to be overloaded. <laughs> Let it out. Here. <laughs> <laughs> nice. He's gonna show me his banana. <laughs> oh. Until next time. Yeah. Until next time. Until next time. You always use this Lawa lens. This is the. Yeah. Well, no, I don't always. Sometimes you use 714. But 714, it yeah. has some really awful, like, stabilization effects at 7 yeah. millimeters. For some reason, this seems a little bit better. Actually, I think a little bit. That's a little bit what, with this as well. When you're tilting up and down, straight lines will not. I mean, they are still strict lines. I mean, parallel lines will not be parallel anymore. When you tilt up, tilt down, those lines are not parallel anymore. Of course, I'm like exaggerated a little bit. When you stabilize a shot, you don't see movement, but then you still see these lines doing this. This is what the warp wobbling effects you see in stabilized wide angle shots. This would be the vlogging lens of choice. 
and yeah. I, I think it's I think it's pretty good. A pretty yeah. good setup. 16 to 35 F for the new Panasonic Series S Pro lens. Actually, my my hand is shaking right now. <laughs> now I think this one H is probably the best. It is the best current 4K camera you can get for your money. Yeah. Well, not for your money. I mean, but with, just uh, in terms of features. For a camera, yeah. I mean, not a Cindy camera. No. As a camera, is everything I can think of that I want. But uh, uh, actually, you can throw in a face detection. But then See, how many megapixels? Phrase. How many megapixels is it? It's twenty, is it? I don't know. It doesn't matter. I forgot. <laughs> I will put it on the screen. I love how you just managed to, to make it sound it like doesn't it doesn't matter. matter. But then he said he forgot. It was just because he forgot. Well, it really yeah. doesn't matter. That's why I forgot. Yeah. I but, mean, it's, but it's, it's more than like... the, it's more than the A7S, yeah. I believe. Yes. Yes. So yes. therefore, it really is a good hybrid camera. It can be good for stills. Mm -hmm. as it well is. As, I mean, the GH5 never uses it for stills. Mm -hmm. And we've got a little bit of uh, noise. <laughs> <laughs> Adding a bit of uh, that was the background noise. That was my son just uh, testing out the <laughs> off-axis really rejection. <laughs> It's quite a, it's a beast of a camera, and I'm not even rolling. Not rolling. <laughs> I can I can share you the footage. Profes professional vlogger. Oh, that's why you that's want why you a telly That's why you need a telly I know. Yeah. I, I, that's why that, that's that's why I need a telly light because I don't think I've recorded any of the footage that I just now shot. Out of place. No, let's go. Let's go. Well, let's actually, where you go? Yes, <laughs> 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 